We've conceived of a device we refer to as a hydrogen sponge. The hydrogen sponge device provides a method for safe generation and storage of hydrogen for use in fuel cell applications. Current methods of hydrogen production and generation involve the use of fossil fuels. One method is from recovery of fossil fuels themselves. As you uh, refine fossil fuels, hydrogen is one of the byproducts. A second method is through water electrolysis. Water electrolysis processes currently involve large amounts of electricity generated by fossil fuel fired power plants. In addition, the methods for storing hydrogen involve using fossil fuel generated power in some form. With this device, that we're trying to get away from that. We're trying to provide a method of storing the gas not under pressure, but in a safe form where it's not explosive, and to, uh, in the same uh, structure, allow a method for generating the uh, hydrogen uh, without using fossil fuels, rather by using solar power. The hydrogen sponge consists of a photovoltaic cell and a uniquely designed silicon substrate. The substrate consists of precisely engineered cylindrical microstructures formed using newly developed high-density vertical via or tunneling fabrication processes. These can be as small as 1 micron in diameter with a separation as small as 10 microns. The microchambers act as both vias for electrodes and very small reservoirs for collection and safe storage of hydrogen in its gaseous form. The photovoltaic cell itself is a version of a standard solar cell design modified to meet the geometrical requirements for this application. When the hydrogen sponge is placed in any ionic fluid and simultaneously exposed to sunlight, solar energy is used to generate hydrogen through water electrolysis and the hydrogen is stored in the substrate microstructures for later use. The stored hydrogen can then be released by increasing pressure in the microchamber through mechanical, electrical, or thermal means. Because the cells are so small, millions of them can be placed in close proximity, much like solar cell arrays. In theory, a 9-inch wafer could have over 60 million microchambers, capable of providing sufficient hydrogen to generate approximately 2.5 joules of usable electric power each second when placed in simple seawater. This assumes a 50% conversion efficiency and represents enough electrical energy to power a fluorescent light bulb for 12 hours a day. This energy rate could be significantly enhanced by stacking multiple wafers or creating different arrays to tailor storage volume to a particular application. This approach and this type of technology becomes a technology enabler for implementation of hydrogen-based fuel cell technology for public use in, in both large and small scale. Spaywar System Center Pacific is a U.S. Navy research and development lab located in San Diego, California. The center is supported by a workforce of 2,000 scientists and engineers who are developing the latest cutting-edge technologies. We are looking for strategic partners to help us commercialize our technologies for DOD and civilian applications. For more information on this technology or any of our technologies, please contact us or visit our website at spaywartechtransfer.navy.mil.